For years, Tennessee State University has struggled to house all of its students. The problem was even worse this year. So bad, in fact, the state may be stepping in. The new report has students worried about what happens next. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs talked to several who say the school does need help, but they don't want the state to take over. Tennessee State University is a dream come true for a lot of African American students. Many TSU students say they chose the school because of its legacy, culture, and community, but they admit housing is a problem. We definitely would love a new dorm, and but housing isn't going to stop TSU. If anything, it's going to allow us to grow, which, like he said, everybody wants to come to TSU. Tennessee State University had a record enrollment in 2022. This is great news, but has caused problems as the campus scrambles to find housing for thousands of its students, like freshman Lanasia Peters, who is staying with family in Antioch. Yeah, I stay all the way out here. I got to commute. Um, a few of my friends don't have roommates, so it's like, if you guys are in overflow, why is there still, you know, empty beds all around campus? Peters says this isn't the college experience she imagined, but she's not giving up on her school. Yeah, I just really hope you know, later on down the line, that'll it'll get better. But from what I'm hearing, it's always been like this. So that's kind of sad. A comptroller's report found TSU's housing troubles will likely only get worse. The school hasn't had enough housing for at least the last five years, which means it had to put thousands of students in nearby hotels. The state says the problems at TSU are so bad, the school needs new leadership. I definitely just say to the lawmakers, be mindful of the legacy that you're trying to change. Um, here at Tennessee State University, we say it all the time, excellence is our habit. And changing how we're governed, it can change a lot of things here for us. In Nashville, Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5. Students plan to rally outside the Capitol tomorrow morning as lawmakers meet to discuss the Comptroller's report.